what's the threat to California's billion dollar agriculture industry? Unwanted pets, uh, pests that is, making their way into the state by hitching a ride in the mail. So what's being done to keep them at bay? CBS 13's Anjali Hemphill is at the post office in West Sacramento getting answers. Dozer the detector dog is hard at work protecting California's agriculture industry. Apples, good boy. Sniffing out any fruit inside the mail that could carry some serious pests. And they're initially trained on five odors, which is apple, citrus, mango, guava, and stone fruit. All hosts for different insects coming into California. Dozer and his trainer, Jennifer Berger, track packages that come through Northern California's largest postal facility in West Sacramento. Good job. Over the last year, dog teams at this facility found more than 170 infested parcels of mail. That's more than all other California post offices combined. Between diseases and insects, there are literally hundreds of things that are on the state's list as being serious potential pests. Yolo County Deputy Ag Commissioner Bill Lyons says insects like these fruit flies found in some guavas from Florida could devastate California crops. If they become too widespread, it becomes very expensive, very difficult to eradicate them. But since using detector dog teams, Yolo County intercepted up to 25 packages a day. A program so successful, the USDA is giving it another $50,000 to add more dogs, like Dozer. It's a true needle in a haystack, and Dozer is the needle finder. I tried it without him for a couple of years, and it was hopeless. Right now, there are nine active detector dog teams in the state. They also patrol shipping facilities for UPS and FedEx.